And welcome back, this is Baller Scuba with an episode of Let's Play Fallout 3, and we've already encountered a, a centaur. Nice work, Fox. Um, I am joined, as always, by Admiral Thunderbolt, who's wearing his Tesla armor today. We are also joined by Fox, who has his Gatling laser primed and ready to take out centaurs. We are headed inside Lamplight, simply because... I never got a chance to make all those jokes that I promised. So I am definitely going to be doing that now. Oh, I've been waiting so long for this. Oh, you you're still here. Account? Of course you do. Yes, yes, Sticky. Um, are you named for uh, how they found you in the morning? Uh yeah, let's go. So apparently now we're going to Big Down because I forgot to, to take the birthday kid over there. So, let's go ahead and do that. Are we there yet? Oh my god, I will shoot you in the face, Sticky. Okay, big town, big town, big town. I believe it's up here. There it is. Don't know why he couldn't have taken this trip himself, but I guess he's not used to taking on giant there rad scorpions. Come on. Yippee! Yeah. You're you're here now. Ta da You're there. I was starting to think the big town wasn't a very good place to live. Uh, are you here now? Will you acknowledge that you are in Big Town? Yeah. I made it to Big Town. Big Town. Hooray! Now I just need to find you. The hell? Okay, uh so uh, apparently we get nothing for that. Nicely done. So let's go back to Little Lamplight then. I never really got a chance to talk to anybody in here anyway, so I'm kind of upset about that. But now's my opportunity to do that. Ah, oh, it's night. Everybody's going to be asleep. Let me put my gun away. Don't want to shoot the kids. I'm sure I lose a hell of a lot of karma for that. Uh, it'd be funny though. It'd be funny. Yeah, everybody's asleep. Freaking kids and their sleep during the night schedule. What the hell is wrong with you? They have an office building, really? Is it cool that I brought a super mutant with you with me? Um hi, Bumble. Why why does your shirt say blast Mom, off? I've never seen a mungo so close. Your eyes are really are far a apart. Or a sleeper. He's a mutant. And if you are, I'm supposed to go hide, cause I'm too young to use a gun yet. Right. I'm a vault dweller. Did you live in the old vault below? No. The mayor doesn't let us go down there because when they went, they didn't come back. Okay, she I has the like someone who didn't the, come the girl back. on the left. She has the creepiest look on her face right now, doesn't she? Uh, why they call you Bumble? It's just a name, okay? Not my fault. I knocked stuff over. Awesome. Lucy says. I Who's Lucy? Bye bye, Bumble. What the hell are you looking at? Hi. Hi. What the hell was that? She like freaking limboed into the chair. Uh, I'm a guest in town. Uh, I don't remember Sammy, but sure. RJ? Mayor McCready, you mean? I spend a lot of time kissing boo boos and making things better. If you get a uh, I have no comment on the little girl kissing boo boos. But I can right. only promise so much. Um, apparently she can heal me. Uh, how do you keep healthy? One big sister or another. Right. And way back when, someone figured out oh. that some of the plants and fungus. The little fungus. Ones don't like to eat their okay, fungus, fungus absorbs like radiation around here. Sounds like it's pretty it useful is, fungus. Especially for dealing with the low level. Right. But it doesn't help the rickets that keep hitting oh, the younger land Oh, you guys get the rickets? Believe it or not, I can make a treatment for that from extract of buff out. From Actually, buff out? if you can talk McCready into it, I'd be glad to trade some fungus for buff out. But he'd have to say it was okay. Uh, that sounds like a deal, actually. Uh, I'll have well, to talk to Mayor McCready about that. Uh, I don't need directions. I'm, I'm cool. Can I pull out my gun while I'm here? I can. Huh. I couldn't. Uh, what else have we got in here? We've got... Oh, 
all this stuff I can't take. I, I can take this stuff here. Like, ooh, garden gnome. I, I'm gonna get one. I'm gonna get one of these. One of them. I'll take your whiskey. Uh, no. Uh, yeah, just the whiskey, I guess. I love me and my whiskey. And how co how come I can't sell the hubcap? Hubcap's got to be worth something, right? Where the hell's everybody else, though? That looks like a skill book, but it's just a ruined book. So, uh, uh, okay, so we got the spelunkers and the great chamber. This way! This place is huge. I mean, seriously. The, the freaking biggest town in all of Fallout 3. Like, inhabited town. And it's freaking the kids' town. Oh, I found food! What's up, kid? Wow. Oh, squirrel. Thanks for the help out there. Right. As far as I'm concerned, you're welcome in here anytime. So, so any why are you called squirrel? I like to think it's because of my inquisitive and charming nature, as well as my natural climbing ability. What do you climb on? But knock knock says it's because I'm totally nuts. <laughs> guess which one's probably right. Uh, take care. I'll try. Nuts, kid. Um. What else? What have we got? Here? What is that? That's oh, just a tin plate. I thought there was something on it. And, uh, mutt fruit. Because why not mutt fruit? What the hell's that? Oh, that's the fungus that they were talking about that I could trade for. It's worth a hell of a lot. Did you see that? It was worth 50. 50 for that cave fungus. And can I take your food? Ow. Eclair's cooler. You guys named a kid Eclair? You guys know what Eclair's are? Wait, I can take this ammo? Okay. Whatever. I'll take it. Oh no, I'm no longer well rested. I didn't even know I was. Okay, let's head into the Great Chamber. What's going on in the Great Chamber? Hey. Hey, Sammy. We didn't need any Mungo's help getting out of there, you know. Whoa. But you did it. So, uh, thanks. What is that with your face? Go back to guarding the back gate with Princess. Who's oh. Princess? No, nope. because Princess always bosses me around, and there's never nothing to gun. Oh, uh, sorry. She's always making fun of me just because she's angry all the time about her nickname and not being in charge and stuff. Stay cool, Sammy. Whatever. Apparently everybody here has a nickname, and they're kind of upset about their nicknames. Whatever. I'm sure the mayor's not upset. What's up, hooligan? Hooligan? Hooligan doesn't want to talk to me. He's a hooligan! He goes out and fights people for his soccer team. That's what hooligans do. Ah, oh, another garden gnome. I'm gonna get one. You Hey, what's up, Mayor? What do you want, Mungo? Stop calling me Mungo. Yeah, how do you organized? Give have you walked around this place? Pure anarchy. I wouldn't have it any other fucking way. Nice. We can't all stay here forever, so we've all gotta leave eventually. And there's not much to look forward to out there. So we have a good time while we're here. And the occasional ruthless little bastard like me makes sure it doesn't fall apart for the other kids. I like letting this kid talk. Because he cusses. And that's good enough for me. How, yeah, it's hey. not that complex. Any kid right. Can. Most of the time, they last until the kids get tired of them. Then they get kicked out on their ass by the new mayor. One only lasted five minutes. Yeah, that was me. Of course, I've it kept wasn't. this place going strong for three years. To most kids, that makes me mayor for fucking life. Fine by me, I say. Sweet. So everyone has to leave? We'll change when they grow up, and we don't trust Mungo's living down here. So we leave for a place called Big Town before we get too old. Right. Kids who grow up fighting and surviving in Lamplight are better trained for the... Okay. I'd like to make a deal. Well, I bet you've heard all about the fungus in my cavern. What the hell? Yeah. Did you make a sex joke? Dude. Reason, we've stayed alive down here. So, you want a slice of that gray What are you offering? Um... I don't know, that seems real mean, so I'm just gonna go for the barter. More stuff for us, and more chance of you getting shot, stumbling back here, choking on your... <laughs> Alright. about this? For every three pieces of strange meat or buff... Did you say strange meat? You'll get one piece of fungus. Take it or leave it. 
Um, okay. Um, wow. They want me to bring them the strange meat. Isn't the strange meat human meat? Yeah, uh, okay. Uh, so they apparently love the taste of humans. These little cannibal kids. Um, <laughs> wow. That was unexpected. Ooh, toolbox. I'll take the conductor. What? What the hell was your problem, dude? What's up, Eclair? Okay, RJ had better have a good reason to let you in. Uh. Um, because right now, all I'm for the kidnap kids. Oh, great! Maybe next he'll take in a death claw or something, and he'll make it the town mascot. Don't even joke anyway, about that, yeah. dude. Thanks for bringing them back in one piece. Maybe next. Right. If you need what passes for food down here, look me up. Name's Eclair. If you so much a snicker, I'll carve you up for steaks. See, even that little kid knows that you get more than one steak out of an entire carcass. Where Honestly, do you get food? When we can't scavenge some from outside, we mostly scrape it off the walls and skim it off the water. Well, that's gross as hell. Not really. Most of our food comes from fungus that grows in these caves. It's right. Not so at least it's filling. So we don't have to eat much. Right. What is it? Yeah. It's pretty hard to find. And I hear it doesn't grow in other caves. I don't know why it's here, but without it, we'd be goners. Huh. Think fungus just grows on trees? No, it grows in caves. Ugh. Knock Knock came up with that one once, and now it's stuck in my head forever. Really? It take any work to get it to grow down that's, here. That's a horrible All joke, dude. All I have dude. to do is collect and prepare it. Mostly, I try to get this. Right. How does it it's grow? Like fungus grows in the pools pool. where the, the first lamp lighters dump the mungos. That's about the most they ever helped us. I don't know how true that is, but I know sometimes the scab team comes back with the strange meat. It tastes terrible, but the fungus...